On this episode of Camera Crusades, I'm in the Grand Tetons National Park. Stay tuned. So today we're headed to the Grand Teton National Park. It should be an incredible trip. We have a couple of killer locations scouted out. Uh, can't wait to get there. So let's hit the road and get into this park and find our first location. So I made it to campsite, a beautiful, beautiful location, Jenny Lake, uh, scored a spot on the fly. They uh, typically only do reservations, but uh, it's worth asking. I, I went up to the kiosk uh, with uh, my buddy Mike and uh, sure enough, they had a last minute cancellation and we scored a spot. So um, as you can see back here, a lot of rain and weather today, but hopefully things will be uh, kind of on the up and up maybe as we go towards sunset and then definitely uh, really, really crossing those fingers for sunrise. Um, hoping for some uh, real calm waters, ideally some great reflections uh, <laughs> on the lake of the Tetons. Going to be incredible. Can't wait. Going to get some dinner going and uh, we'll move from there. So just behind me is Jenny Lake, just shrouded in fog this morning. But I gotta tell you, it's it's kind of peaceful. It's very exciting. Water is like very, very calm. So if these clouds will dissipate as that sun comes up and it warms up a little bit, uh, this could be a ridiculous location. So as uh, I learned my lesson yesterday, uh, right now might not be good, but wait an hour and things can change. So let's stick around. Uh, I do like this kind of minimalist uh, thing back here with the white and the black and these rocks in the foreground. So I'm gonna take a few shots here um, while I wait and then we're gonna kind of see how things turn out in an hour or so. So as you can see, right
right here is the Molten Barn, uh, one of several in the area, one of the iconic ones. There are two in, uh, in this facility that have a very similar shape and both have um, become kind of that classic iconic shot of the Tetons with the barn. However, just like Jenny Lake, um, weather is just so low cloud today that it's not really conducive to see the mountains at all. So I'm just kind of maximizing my time here, shooting around and enjoying the landscapes uh, that I can get. Grand Teton National Park is flat out uh, just unpredictable, uh, but in the best possible way because you wait a couple hours, the conditions change. It's insane. I love it. I freaking love it. Had a blast. These mountains are out of control. The Just the landscapes themselves out of control. Rivers, mountains, weather, everything you could possibly want in one park ridiculous. I hope you enjoyed coming along with me to Grand Teton. If you did, make sure you take a second to subscribe to Camera Crusades, give this video a big thumbs up, and I'll see you in that next adventure.